A spark in... Mobius? Impulsive pair ye two make. Anyway, cool your heads and have some grub with me. W grub? You need food if you want energy. Don't go telling me you don't eat now. Yeah, get real. What's this deal? But you're all skin and bones, a lot of you. Right, laddie. All right, steady on. Anyhow, I'm not even hungry. I'm not gonna bite your heads off, Pip Squeaks. Don't just stand there. What do we do? I guess we can't just ignore him. Ah, I do love the sea. So I'm taking this thing on a trip. From Mobius? On a trip? Of course! A man's life is a long journey. Walk your path without a destination, and you'll get little encounters like this one. Yeah, uh, if you think we're gonna trust a Mobius, you're off your rocker, man. Ho oh, ho! Sounds like you're an awful pickle and no mistake. What a disaster for ye. But you see, Mobius I may be, but I don't got any orders regarding ye. I'm a free agent, says I. Anyway, there are things on the sea so tasty they'll make you weep, along with some gigantic monsters. So I arrange for them to be here. Things you land lovers would never dream of. You mean you're mixing the colony up in all this? Just so you can have a bit of fun. Guess you're right. I just love watching the sea from a Faranus, truth be told. Therefore, free agent that I be, I work as Colony 15's consul with a spot of moonlighting as the commander. The other Mobius tell me rubbish like your name is T. Perhaps it's fate I met up with you lot. So if you please, you can call me Captain Triton. Um, somebody tell me what's happening? Captain Triton, I get what you're saying, I do, but... Noah, you ain't humoring this windbag. Indeed. Can't listen to any words from this man's mouth. His crazy, reckless schemes will get friends dead, smashed to pieces. And what? Once I get an idea, I have to put it in motion. Otherwise, nothing around here would happen. The captain's awesome. He might be an ugly lump, but he can smash a big monster clear into next year. Well, I like a good challenge. So we spend a chunk of time going around it. Wait, who are you calling ugly? Whether they're in the sea or the sky, we find big nasties and biff them up good. Right, gotcha. You definitely called me ugly. Look, Mia, we're better off keeping away from this lot. You can't be best pals with a Mobius. Come now, young folk. You only just arrived. Fancy a little contest. A contest? The wind brings me a couple of rumors, such as all of ye being pretty capable. Seeing fellow warriors always gets me fired up. So, it be contest time. What are you on about? No way I'm doing that. Scared, eh? Eh? Hi, your lily livers. Huh. Guess Ouroboros just run away with their tails between their legs. 
That right? Ha! Lily Liver! Who are you calling Lily Livered? Just leave it, Lance. You're wasting your time bothering with someone like him. Must be nice for you, leaving one foot out the door, so the sparks won't fall on you when there's trouble. You're frightened of getting knocked down, so you're making out like you're warning him. You trying to save face or something? Be you so scared of Mobius? That's Lily Livered, or my name's not Captain Triton. I'll give you Lily Livered. Fix settle then. Been looking for someone hot-blooded. Happy? Make the preparations. Men of the Sea, Triton's Triple Challenge. My power vested in Appy. Appy will now explain rules of contest. Huh? You mean we're actually going through with this? Uh... Rules are simple. In vicinity of Colony 15, there are three islands. Each island have specific challenge. Team that solves challenge fastest wins points. <laughs> if that's all we need to do, this will be incredibly simple. I totally thought this was going to be a big punch-up. <laughs> Where's your sense of romance? Ain't no contest in a straight-up fist fight. For friends' informations, Colony 15 soldiers wait on each island to observe contest. Contest teams are... All of Friends team versus the captain and three others. Hey, so we have a bigger team. Doesn't seem fair. Phoebe guests, you see. I'll accept a handicap by way of hospitality. Oi, are you having a laugh? Ignore it. He's just provoking you. A man doesn't go back on his word. Now then, all of you, get to it! Friends prepared? First challenge is at Ishan Isle. Talk to Ronya to find out more. Let contest begin! Never been here before. Is there we have some like new names. A rare thing? Might as well claim this. We have some new names registered. Huh. New allied colony data. Huh. Is that what I think it is?
We have some new names registered. I guess. Charge off on your own. This is something decent, right? Should be time for dinner soon, right? And we're done. I saw it all. <laughs> Looks like you're all mouth and no... Uh. Look at you. You're knackered. I must have ate a bad shrimp or something. But don't you even think about backing out now. Who's backing out? We're the ones kicking... Oh, good thing we found this.
that what I think it is? Everyone, get some rest. It's best we talk this through. Thanks ever so much. All charged up and ready to go.
be our target. Ah, oh, I'm so glad we found it. Whoa, got a rare doodah right here. Good thing we found this. and done it now. We've never been here before. It shouldn't have fallen far. Let's try looking. Target. So that's what the noise was all about. Huh. Good thing we found this. Quite a rare sight. Guys, get ready to fight! Ah, I'm getting the blue! Keep it up, Leo!
think it is. Hey, this one means business. I'll draw the reinforcements. A bit of teamwork couldn't handle. Whatever happened to not being careless? I wonder what's around here. on fighting that. This is what we've picked. Oh ho! Yeah, they be. All right, beef. Unlike some people, I have a more discerning eye. Uh, anyway, what have you got? Ha ha ha! You reckon you'll beat me? Say that again. This is what I brought. Whoa! Oh, good choice, Captain. This local fruit is said to be jawed. Totally true. Hmm. That... Our guests have... What? I did ask for the most valuable booty. What our guests have brought sells for ten times more than that coconut. And while the coconut is certainly delicious, it... Maybe the value is only so-so, but have you seen it? Bigger be better than smaller, says I. Friend right! Taste a lot... Hey, whose side are you on, Shortcake? Manana will not make fibs. Tell Manana what's more important. You can't say fairer than that. No, you did not win. Captain, accepting defeat. Ugh, but the next one's gonna be mine. You come to Cape Arca. Oh. That man is a few screws.
pretty rare specimen. your everyday job. I think I could stare at that. Well, we've been found. Oh, no, 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 no,
Good friends. You're supposed to be taking down that monk. No, you'd scuttled off somewhere, so we had to get the deeps from. Well, that's no good then, is it? If you waste time here. We followed the tracks. Ah, we got more tracks here? Oh, my. Good luck, friends. You best not hang about, or the captain will sail ahead. We have some new names registered. I think I could stare at that forever. Okay, well, we're doing this. What? Oh. Divine. Quit being an idiot. Stay back. No love lost! The oh, oh, yeah! Great! Get crushed! Wait! Feel that! 
Now that's what I'm talking about. Now that was a bone. Where are the others? Yeah. That buffoon. Big Lug still isn't here. No. Friends have come back before arrival of Captain. Have to say, Captain is not most punctual. Ah! Oh, don't tell me we're pipped to the post again. Captain! Captain is late. Is never a good thing to make guests wait. It was a piece of cake. Maybe we should have given you a handicap. Of contest, our honored guests. Man of the Sea, Triton's Triple Challenge, Part Four. What? The last challenge be a good old punch up. The winner gets, uh, what do I need? Um, seven points. What he said. Good. Now, put him up. Oh, this is taking the piss. It's called the Triple Challenge. Yes, we agree for once. What happened to a man doesn't go back on his word? <laughs> you be right. He doesn't. But a man always wants more. Ugh, this clod. What crud is he spouting now? It's the same stuff he's been spouting from the start. Huh? Lance! Huh? You better pay attention. Man of the sea, sucker, punch! Lance! You okay? What a bloody underhanded way to start a fight, asshole! Carelessness on the sea gets you killed. A man's gonna pay attention every second of every minute. Sorry, Captain can't be stopped when he gets like this. Friends, watch out or get sucked into Captain Tornado! Oh, a snuffing sucker punch. Now you're in for it. Playtime's over, matey! Ah, how about you then? I think you all out at once.
so it's settled, right? We totally won this bloody thing. Man, what a real mudder of a Mobius. Oh, my aches have aches. Huh. <laughs> you fested me. He ain't half strong. It wasn't exactly one-on-one. -on -one. To be sure, I'd have beaten any one of ye in a fair fight. But I feel no ill will. Been a while since anyone knocked me down. Well, I'm feeling all kinds of ill. He snuffing sucker punch me! I have a question. If you're a Mobius, you could have transformed at any time, right? So, why didn't you do it? Ah, young'un. Only thing I trust are these old bones and my own two fists. In a brawl, anything else kind of takes things. Besides, using anything else be no fun at all. I feel that. I think. Ah, truth be told, I've been alive so long, I've clean forgot how to transform. <laughs> oh, for sparks, don't know why I asked. By the by, wonder if I could ask you a favor. Come on. Think it's a bit early in our relationship for that. If I let this get away from me now, I might not remember again. I gave up thinking ahead long, long ago, see? Well then, what is it that you need? Ah, well, I want you to smash that big old shiny thing. That's your flame clock. Mate. Do you even have a clue what you're saying right now? I've been waiting for this moment. For that thing to disappear, see? Are you really sure? Yeah, tear it down, says I. Well, I'm around to watch it happen. Here we go. Finally, you're free, friends. Huh. I know it's a bit late to ask this, but are you sure this is okay? Now, you boys and girls might not be understanding this. I've been a Mobius for a long time, seen and learnt a lot about death. The thing with death is, it doesn't care about your feelings. It just comes when it wills. Now, I've seen people who live short but full lives. People who cling to every last bit of life. People who are only to it. I've encountered so many people. I've lost count. But good or bad, they die while I carry on. But... But of course that's going to happen with the way the world is. If I'm going to accept things just because that's how they are, then maybe I've been living too long. Watching the way they lived, I ended up thinking, wondering what fun these people could get up to if they were free. Something fun. Maybe something stupid. Fun? Sure. I think about Dudley, best strong man I ever saw. Or Serena, nobody loved to see like her. Ghoul had no equal in battle. I knew all sorts of spirited folk, but no matter who they were, the flame clock would end up being their reason for living. I wanted to do something, but not even these boat hooks could put a dent in that blasted thing. You mean you tried to do it as a Mobius? Aye, but nothing came of it. That's when it really hit home that I was a Mobius. I couldn't destroy the flame clock, and after a while, I just gave up. Isn't that ironic? Man, and here I thought you were just some giant without a thought in his head. Turns out there's a bit more to you. <laughs> It'd be true. Getting the old noggin going is not a skill I possess. But round about the time I gave up thinking about anything, I started hearing about you lot. About us? Yep. Some idiots going around beating up Mobius, smashing up flame clocks, things of that ilk. Need I explain any more? I knew 
You were the ones who could release my friends, trapped by that infernal clock. Well, we did do that. Indeed. I suppose you could say that us destroying the flame clock set your friends free. But that doesn't mean that your friends would have got the same lease on life as Mobius. You don't have come out with some tripe, Four Eyes. Four Eyes? My name is Tyon. I be talking about in here. The heart? That's right, Gert. It doesn't change anybody's lifespan. But in that moment, it's the bonds between us all that change. But you're a consul. You're telling me something's changed between you and your underlings. I think you know the answer, boy. We be equal now, not tied to each other by time. Or who be above and who be be equal? Hi, me and ye are equals. We've had a good brawl, and now there's no grudges. So, what will you do now? Good question. I reckon I'll find the next big beastie and beat the snot out of it. <laughs> huh? Didn't really think I'd be fighting Mobius. Ah, but I'm a big boy. It'll... You mean you're joining us? Yep. I bet you feel all kinds of reassured. Uh, I mean, you are pretty tough. Wait, wait, wait. Did you forget where Uro borrows? And he's Mobius. You're gonna go against your own kind. Too right. You could live a thousand years and not get the chance to team up with Uro Burris and take a pop at Mobius. I may like an odd scrap with some toughens, but going on some idiot adventure with them sounds fun too. What do you think? He doesn't seem the type to have any ulterior motives. There's one. I've a debt to pay ye, and I've decided I'll pay it now. Otherwise, ye softies will get knocked down by the next breeze that comes along. And not because you're planning on punching us when our backs are turned? Nope. When I have a problem with somebody, I be the sort to tackle it head on. I mean, no. You definitely punched me when I wasn't looking. Have asked with your pesky details. Come on, this is a good deal. All right, you convinced me. You sure? You can't say you hate him after listening to all that. That's true. Okay, you're on the team, Tripe. Glad that didn't take long. I like a good snappy decision, so I do. But if you put one foot wrong, we're kicking you out faster than you can say Ouroboros. Ha <laughs> ha! I shan't cross my heart. Just you watch, boy. I got my own special power I can help you out with. Oh, yeah? I'll keep my expectations low. I'd better relay the tale to my men. Oh, one last thing. Huh? What is it now? I got feelings deep as the sea, which I like to pound into some tough enemies. Now, I want to fight forever. But when I became a Mobius, that's when I realized that one human life would always have felt too short. I've lived my life in fear. But now, a quick scuffle with you all has helped clear things up for me. I really felt alive. Uh... I'd be grateful. <laughs> Get... <laughs>
new names registered. So I got a whacker. I can do that. as well, yeah? Some relationships changed.
always a joy to beat up someone stronger than yourself. Nothing we can't handle. Who's with me? Well, there's a wheel down the way. And I was the M. There's tough, and there's tough. Nothing we can't handle. Who's with me? I know. Gotta pull my weight, too. No, 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 no. about that one. Get a load of its mob. Looks like a tough customer. I know. Please work with me a little. You what? You're supposed to be following me.
a joy to beat up someone stronger than yourself. Gotta be a toughie, huh? Nothing we got. Who's with me? Got to allow for this challenge now and again. And I was the MVP. You're all thinking it. 